All right. Now, this is a generic filter, air filter. Yeah, if I can get it out of the box, that'll actually fit near my little trim. I can put, oh, and that one will fit right in there too. Oh, oh Jesus. This is probably going to work better than I thought. Okay. Should I make that? No. I was going to say, if I did make that a little longer, it would have been all set there. But I think this is going to be okay. Yeah. Uh, the old scrub board. Guys, probably some of you don't even know what that. Is. All right, so we do have to do this a little better, and I can do some more from back here. But it doesn't make a difference really. Uh, it's probably okay, but I don't want it to fall apart under the vibrations. You know, the good vibrations. So we're going to have to do a little bit more, just a little bit, just a little bit, okay, uh, let me do this over there. I wanted to clean that off a little bit, just to give me a little bit better ground. Okay, I don't want to put a piece of metal down, like the piece I just used for this, because uh, I don't want to accidentally go through the hole and tack to it. No, I don't. See, I want it to suck from both. If I just have, and I put a solid cap top on this, then it's only going to be sucking from the back, which is hot naturally from the heat from the motor so I'd rather have it sucking from the front so uh, if it sucks from both sides I really don't care so I think what I'm going to do is cut a piece out of this and do a front do a full frontal Ooh. Ooh. Babuski. Well, I don't. I don't know where to scribe went. You should stick it up right there. I'm trying to let her, trying to talk her into letting me make her a throwaway. Now so far, her effort's been pretty good other than the high school acting up last week. Shit happens, what are you going to do? However, however, uh, what do I do with them? Oh, here they are.
All right, we're down to nothing now. Let me get rid of that. Let me get another one on there. Okay, what about this one? All right, now, if I remember right, I didn't need it anymore. I was done. So let's get this on. No, nope, you stay. Okay. Okay. Now, this has to be flattened out a little bit. Throw it a little wide. the back, this is the front, and that's going to go there. Now, how am I going to keep it there? That's what I want to know. Oh, an inch. I know what I might be able to do here. Yes, I do. I'm working with small, thin stuff, so, and I'm not a uh, good welder to start with. Let's put it this way, I can make it stick, it's just that it may not look good. That one's not going to work, oh, stop that. Away with one hinge, uh, less welding that I have to do. So let's see. Yeah, I think this may be the way to go. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. One hinge is really all I need. However, I got to make sure that I can get this. No, see, that's not going to work. I can't hinge it. Because if I ever have to take the carburetor off, I gotta be able to open that door. I wonder what would happen if I just bungee corded it. I don't think it's gonna get that hot. Put this back. Hold on. The hinge would have been good, but there's not enough room. So, we got to be able to actually move it, not just open it, because there's a bar here, the frame, so I can probably open it enough to get the, um, filter in and out of it, but I'm not going to be able to open it enough to get the carburetor if I have to take the carburetor off. And if I put a track anywhere, there's no room for it to slide. So it's got to come off. So, if I put a little hook over here and a little hook over there, I can probably just use a piece of cordage or here and here maybe yeah you can always put a little something here to stop it from sliding down here to here with a little nipple stiffen up there so let's try that 
Let's take this over there. I don't know if I changed the drill bit or not. Hold on. Well, I got one here a little bit in it. I do, I do. 